Here's how you find three equivalent fractions for the whole number 10. First off, we're going to consider this to be 10 over 1. That's because 10 divided by 1, it's still 10. It's just that now we have a fraction. And this is equivalent. This is an equivalent fraction to the whole number 10. So if we took the numerator here and the denominator and doubled them, multiplied them both by 2, that would give us another equivalent fraction to 10. 2 times 10, that's 20. 2 times 1, that's 2. So 20 over 2, that's equivalent to 10 over 1, or 10. Divide 20 by 2, you get 10. It's an equivalent fraction. How about we multiply the numerator and the denominator by 3? 3 times 10 is 30. 3 times 1 is 3, another equivalent fraction. One more. How about we multiply the numerator and the denominator by 7? 7 times 10, that's 70. And 7 times 1 is 7. So these are all equivalent fractions for 10. If you divide 70 by 7, 30 by 3, 20 by 2, or 10 by 1, you get 10, the whole number. That's because these are all equivalent fractions. This is Dr. B. Thanks for watching.